Okay. Today we will learn the pen input. Pen input. You remember the delivery guy when he comes to your house, he asks you to sign, and that's what we're gonna learn. We go here, text, pen input. Just to see some properties of text, a uh, pen input, we will also put one image. But before that, we will run it vanilla clean. Oh, I don't want you to know my signature, so I will mess it up. A messed up version of my signature. So, pen input. Clean. Okay, so we will also put one image. So, we can extract the value of the signature and we put it here. Okay. We'll also put one button. So once the signature is over, we will press the button and whatever image is here, it will come up here. So first we will do, we'll do set variable. This is variable VAR image, a temporary holder for the image. Pen input one dot image. And this property of this image, instead of sample image, will put as variable image. Whatever variable you have set. So whatever variable value has been set, it will get assigned on the button click. When the button select variable image, we get the image from here. Whatever image is here, we put it in this image control. So let's run this. That's my legal signature on my passport. This is my sign. Button and you get my image. That's it. So once again the code, simple code. This is the pen input and then it has a property image. When the button is clicked, we are creating a variable VAR image and then we are assigning this image to this image control. So a pen input control, image control and a button. When you click the button, whatever image is here, it will be assigned here. So let's say if I clean the image and I press the button, dong, 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 the image is clear. When I sign something here, press the button, the signature will come here. We will learn, later on we will learn how to take this image and send it in the email as an attachment. But for now, that's it. Have a wonderful day.